Hello friends, this is Brian Weller with Message Ministries and Missions. And uh, I am down here in Lima, Peru. We are working on the Peru Flood Relief Project. I'm in uh, Marcus, which was not affected by the floods. That's where the river is, and it's high enough that no water got over. But what we're doing here is uh, we've taken the donations that many of you have given and you have donated and we've gone out and we've purchased things like Avena, which is kind of like an oatmeal. We've got rice, we've got sugar, we've got evaporated milk. We have toiletry items and other things like that. And I'm going to take you inside where some of the youth and young adults are helping to package all these things together so that we can then bring them to the flood areas. Now this particular uh, batch of food and supplies is going to Warme and uh, we'll be going there on Saturday and so we'll probably take three or four or five vans and we'll also be doing children's ministry and we'll be doing a, uh, a street outreach as well because we want them to know that Jesus Christ is the reason that we're doing what we're doing and that he is the only hope and uh, you know always say uh, you give people some food it may last for a few days and we definitely want to do that we want to help people but we want to give them something that will help them get through the days and the weeks and the months and the years ahead and the only true hope that's going to do that is Jesus Christ so come on with me we're going to go inside and uh, see what they're doing here so here we go you can see we've got uh, some of these different items and uh, things are being uh, broken down in the smaller quantities and uh, then they're put in these bags here that's Ruben working hard and uh, you see got a lot of teamwork going and uh, what, what I like about this it's the Peruvian people doing the work This is in Cajamarquilla, that's where the people are living now, and this is where a lot of the sewing took place. A lot of people worked in sewing garments and what have you, and it's, it's pretty much, it's all gone. You can see the workplace is under, under mud now, under dirt. The dirt is now solid, and over in that area is where the homes were.